grew up on the north side of Chicago. My dad was a Cub fan. My grandfather was a Cub fan. I'm a Cub fan, and my son's a Cub fan. I retired at the end of uh, 2005, and I started here as a tour guide. This is my office. The whole atmosphere here is very family-oriented. These aren't employees, they're family. So I started in 2003 with the Cubs, working on a marketing department. I was an intern doing special events in game entertainment. This is my 14th season. It's kind of a dream come true. Obviously working with the Cubs is something I always wanted to do and I was passionate about. But then you kind of get the icing on the cake and you work with my dad. You know, we're both busy on game days, but whether it's just a quick hello or see what's happening at the house or he's asking about his grandkids, Shockingly, they live 20 seconds away and I barely see him when we're back home, so this is actually a chance to kind of catch up with him each day. Do you remember when we were up in the back of the bleachers oh, for yeah, the rain for, for the Dodgers? Oh yeah, birthday party. Yeah. <laughs> well, did you work in 07? 07 and 08, yeah. 07 and 08 when he was working here. And we actually got to watch a game uh, in 08 together. As I get a little bit older now and I've had a chance to appreciate these things, I think looking back, I'm gonna realize how special it was to be able to work with my dad and see him every day. And I think that ultimate dream is to be here together when they win the World Series. There's this latent desire to see the final success, and it's something that I look forward to sharing with Jim. Unfortunately, my father and grandfather won't be here to see that, but uh, they'll be looking down. And uh, anybody who's not from Chicago may not fully understand that, but you just have to put it in perspective of there might be some dream out there that you want to reach for and you haven't gotten. And, uh, that, uh, that desire lingers. Mm -hmm.